have three of the fastest swimmers in history in this event. Three of the top ten in history, right here. Yeah, because Rilov is backed up by Clement Kolesnikov, who is a huge backup. Again, that's the key to ISL, Roddy, is you gotta have some depth. Yeah, and and, and I think if you if you talk about Cali, you, 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 there's really no true superstar on this team. And I say that again with some trepidation because you're looking at a true superstar in Ryan Murphy, but he can only swim backstroke. They don't have a Caleb Dressel. They don't have a, 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 um, a swimmer that can really put it together, Sarah Shoyston, for example. So they've got to really count on these big points in the backstroke with Murph. There's no doubt about it. Radislav Kaveki is in the lead. He won this event in College Park a season ago for the Cali Condors, pushing the pace early on. And there's a big difference between the lane assignment between Murphy and Kaveki, who's in the middle of the pool. That's one of the differences is you get to swim with your teammate in ISL. Well, Kaveki, I mean, think about that one-two punch. We keep talking about Reloff, but look at the one-two punch they have just in the backstroke alone with Kaveki and Reloff, who, by the way, is a much better back half swimmer. He is a better 200 backstroker normally. But again, we have no idea what kind of shape these guys are coming in. All right, it's going to be a race down to the wire this final 50 meters. Cali Condor is trying to get their second event win. Kaveki turns first. Ryan Murphy trying to give him chase. This is clear cut. No closeness here. Relov trying to close, but it's going to be the Condors. Radislav Kaveki, 148.51. Murphy will finish second, about two tenths behind. And it's first and sixth for the Cali Condors.